Kia ora. So today we're going to learn how to use the batch calculator. So we're going to go to resources, batch size calculator, open calculator, and here we are. So I'm going to enter all of the ingredients that I want to use in descending order. So the most to the least. So we come down here and we've got our percentages here. So we need that to total 100. So I'm going to start at the bottom because I know I want to use vitamin E at 0.5%. And when I click out of that, there we go, it starts to add it up. So Q10 recommended dosage usage is 1%. So then I'm going to come up to the top and I know I want to predominantly use plum kernel oil. So when I click out of the box, there we go. 51.5 and then I fill up the gaps. So next one's going to be raspberry. So now for my last one, I need to turn that 81.5 into 100. So how's my math? Is it 20%? What? No, I've gone over. So I have to take off 1.5%, which brings us to 185 and boom, there we go. Now we've got 100%. So, up here in the amount that I want to make, that's a kilo, that's a bit much. I'm gonna make 100 grams. So I'm gonna come down here and click calculate, which is unfortunately, my screen grab didn't quite get all of it, so the calculate button is down the bottom there. So you can see your percentages there, and then calculate it into grams, 100 grams, is pretty simple because it's literally exactly the same. But then if I want to change it and only make 20 grams, I come back down and I hit calculate again. And then it gives you the amounts that you want to use of each ingredient that total one, uh, total 100%, but total 20 grams. So sometimes making really small amounts can be kind of difficult because you're Scales need to be really good, like 0.1% or 1 gram is quite hard to get. So I'm going to split the difference and make 50 grams. If I really, really like my formula, I might make 5 kilos. So this is just an example of how you can make any amount you want once you've got your percentages right. But I'm going to stay with the 50 grams. So here we are. Those are my gram amounts to make 50 grams of this formula. Now I'm going to enter in my directions so that when I print it out, I'll have those there and I can take that into my lab. And I'm gonna give it a name. Q10 Summer Fruits Facial Serum. And then I'm gonna come down here. And again, the print button is just out of frame. I'm going to print it. And now I've got my formula printed out and ready to go.